city, but they don't care to dance with me. But it ain't my fault that the fields are muddy and the red clay stains my feet. It's under my nails and it's under my collar that it shows on the Sunday clothes. But I'll do my best when it's open that damn old dirt won't go. Just a red clay road with a red clay wings and a red clay hill for my head. I really started by wanting the people that came to the festival to, to feel like they were coming to a party that I was giving. And, uh, you know, that, that was sort of the way I felt, and that everybody would be welcomed with a smile. My name's Gabriel Bosco, my mother Judy Bosco. We are a lifetime Gray Fox enthusiast. I've been going all 19 years from in the womb, and uh, I think I'll be here till I'm in my grave. Um, I would say it's different and it's like good in its own way every year. Like, but I think it kind of gets better just because now, like, I've been coming here for three years, so I know a lot of like I feel more comfortable here and like. I feel like now I ha we have like a group of friends and everything that I know. Hi, my name is Sylvia. Um, I'm the owner of Vagabondia Vintage and Handmade, um, and I'm here with my mobile boutique for the second year at Gray Fox. I've been coming up for about 10 years as a camper, um, but I'm so thrilled to be part of the vending family. So come by if you guys are around. Uh, I, I love talking to people and hearing your stories and just chatting it up. I like the Gray Fox family and come on by and come make a new friend. Hey there, I'm Janet Braley from Gray Fox Bluegrass Festival. We're gonna take you backstage and you can see what it looks like. We're uh, backstage operations here. This is the backside of our t-shirt booth and all the merchandise. Lots of cool tie-dyes and other festival gear. There's the guys who run the t-shirt crew. You guys say hello to the camera here. This is a t-shirt crew. They make it happen right here. We're coming backstage, the staging area where the artists are tuning up and getting ready to go on for their sets. Right now we have Billy Strings and Don Julian playing on the main stage. This is our backstage hospitality tent where we feed all our volunteers and our artists and the staff. We have breakfast, lunch, and dinner here made by Chris Matson. Him and his crew do a fantastic job. And here comes Lisa Houston, our office manager, vendor coordinator. Bill Noten, one of our MCs, standing back here. We have massage available for our staff and artists. A little different angle. It's a little dark, but... This is where you can just come in, get out of the sun and relax. Here's some of the bands, the band from Front Country over here. Hey guys. First time at Gray Fox, how's it going for you? <laughs> it's not a lot, it's not big back here, but it makes it happen. I guess it looks like notes, some are notes to the bands, but it looks like we have a lot of set lists that are hanging here. That seems like what we saw 
at the Gray Fox Jam last night with Daryl Anger and Rashad and Joe Craven. Turkey in the Straw, that number six there, that was fantastic. Hi, so here Artist we are Academy at Bluegrass. the Gray Fox Bluegrass Festival, and now we're on the other day, side of the stage, and over library. here we have our and artist merchandise the booth, they have where you can buy all stuff from your favorite bands, like CDs Manlin, and everything, but Brian we also Sutton, sell guitar, recordings Darryl of the live set, so you Andy see Hall, something Andy that Ripley's you really love, come on over here and you can go home listening to like your favorite sets from Gray Fox. So over here we have our raffle booth. And we have these beautiful instruments from a Collings guitar. You can see it has really nice Gray Fox inlay on the fretboard. We have an Eastman fiddle, a Deering banjo, a Northfield mandolin, and a Beard guitar. And we'll be raffling those off on Saturday night and Sunday afternoon. Everybody who wins an instrument also wins a year subscription with ArtistWorks. Academy of Bluegrass so if you win the guitar you also get a year of lessons with Brian Sutton and we think that's pretty cool. Gray Fox is great. It's a little warm today but music is cooling us down and we're having a blast. Every year 31 and counting. Yeah. Festival's gone super super super. See any new bands that you? Uh, Billy Strings for the first time. Pretty awesome pretty awesome probably a rising star obviously a rising star. Yeah, yeah so uh, for everybody really. Girls are going crazy for them. Mm -hmm. Guys wishing they can play like that. <laughs> I'm wishing I could play like that. I'm with the Schooner Bar, part of the Creature Corner. Oh. Yeah, and we're from, my person is from Asbury Park, New Jersey. But it's about the people. You see the best of people. Beautiful. Love it. Enjoy. We'll have to come down to the Schooner Bar. You need to. It's yeah. the best place in the world. All right. It is. Oh. It is first time. Where are you from? I'm from Philadelphia, outside Philadelphia. Right. How did you hear yeah. about Ray Fox? Uh, just from friends, yeah. friends who playing music, jamming with others, and heard about it and had to come. You know, uh, the people are just so hospitable. They really are. So many nice people. So many parties to go to, and you just don't want to leave. The people are great. It's a, such a great time. So, what do you think? It's your first Gray it, Fox. It won't be your last. It, it won't like. be my last. And I don't know if it's the music or people, but it, it, the music just does something to the people that it's just great. How about you, ladies? Is this your first Gray Fox? It this is. is our first Gray We're Fox. We're from Michigan. Really? Yes. yes. We came all the way from Michigan. No kidding. Yes. No kidding. Think about it. Oh, because gosh, I'm lying. And our yeah, favorite yeah. band is playing in it. It's Green tonight. Sky Bluegrass. Green Sky Bluegrass uh, representing Kalamazoo, boys. Michigan. All right. <laughs> and Billy Strings. And Billy Strings and Don, Don Julian, Traverse City, Michigan. All right. Yeah. Nice. Representing. Yeah, we're we loving it. it. It's beautiful. Great. Beautiful. You thought it would be in more and more. It really is. Yeah. You know, actually, we're like, this is like a step up from what we're usually used to as far as like there's what, running water and. Absolutely. We can wash our hands after we just go to and the And it was restroom. nice because you can save spots for your friends. So our friends got here, our local friends, a day early, oh, saved us some land. Nice. So we could drive up from Michigan. So we're great, happy to be here. Fantastic. <laughs> Have a great time. Is this your first Gray Fox? No, this is our third Gray Fox, so we're, we're loving it. We, it's like a pilgrimage to come here every year, and now it's, we, we can't miss it. So all right, all right. I see you have an instrument there. Are you yes, part of the Kids Academy? No, he was the last two years. He's um he's actually one of the top banjo players in New England for kids. But he just started mandolin because he graduated from banjo for, with his teacher. So now he's starting mandolin. No so, kidding. Yeah. What's your name? Um, I'm Chris Pike. Chris Pike. We're gonna have to remember that name, right? You're yeah. gonna be playing on that stage one day, maybe, huh? Hopefully. All right. <laughs> good. Good. Hey, uh, we're balloon man at Jerry's uh, Corner. How many balloons have we handed out about so far? We handed out about 50 or 60. And uh, uh, how many smiles on kids did we get, you think? Uh, 50 or 60 balloons, 120 smiles. Molly, can you feel me? Uh. I think it's lightening up.
prayed to feed themselves and the cattle everyone and they prayed to feed Studios. We're a collective based out of North Adams, Massachusetts, and we sell all different styles of handmade jewelry. We make all of our glass pieces, and then we have the work of several other American artisans. All of our work is ethically produced in North America, and it is all available for free shipping at DazzleStudios.com. Hi, my name is Ron, and my wife Karen's sitting over there. We're gypsies from St. Louis. I uh, built the gypsy wagon about four years ago. Uh, became obsessed with building it. I built it in like a month. And then we've been doing festivals for about, I don't know, five years. We do it mostly for fun and enjoyment of uh, music festivals. Well, we make uh, folk art instruments out of barn wood. Lately, I've been doing license plate instruments. And, uh, we also sell festival flags. And the main uh, business is my cutting board business. I've been doing it for about 30 years. Uh, we do them in the shape of uh, instruments. It's red and white oak. Uh, we do little ceiling tin magnets for refrigerator magnets. Fair trade jewelry from Guatemala. It's all made from guitar strings and coconut shells. We'll, come by and, we'll all come by and see and say hello. Okay. Take it easy. Thanks again, Ron. Take it easy. You are fine out of the blue. I never expected to be loved by 